So what is going on guys, welcome back to another episode of Watchdog. Sorry about last episode guys, about it getting all corrupt and everything uh, towards the end there. Uh, if you checked it out, but anyway, I'll be quiet while we listen to this message. You made a lot of noise at Rossi Fremont. Please give me good news. Arax got dirt on a lot of people. Hold on guys, what I'm going to do is I'm actually just going to set the... Oh. I'll set the waypoint the and head back there. Everybody from politicians to CTOS execs. The Merlot is in there too. I knew it. I told you it was there. It's encrypted. I don't have access to it, but that video we found at the Merlot, the woman's name is Rose Washington. Rose Washington? I know that name. Wasn't she with CTOS? Aiden, you've hit pay dirt. I followed your IP. Now give me my sister. But we're just starting. That video is important to someone. Important enough to attack me, to attack your niece. Careful, Damien. Come on, I know you want to follow this to the end as much as I do. That was an ordeal. Oh, but it was. You said it's encrypted. Then your job's not done. No, you're not gonna do this. I can do whatever I want. Hey, it's me. Nikki, how you doing? I'm tired. They're taking care of me, I guess. Just come get me, please. Okay, there's other people with you. Alright, that's fine. Just be ready for anything. I'm coming to get you. I need to see Jax. How's he doing? He's... He's a brave boy. Takes after his mother. But he's stubborn like his bullheaded uncle. <laughs> yeah, I guess he is. Doesn't take no for an answer. Time's up. Ta-ta. Right, sorry about that guys, I was just driving around. This from Damien. It's working an angle. I want something more. Alright. One thing at a time. I'm gonna need the rest of Iraq's blackmail. Then I got leverage. And then I can deal with Damien. So yeah, sorry about last uh, episode guys. Um I don't know what happened to it, but uh, for some strange reason it went all corrupt and everything. So, um, if I have to cut out or anything in the future episodes, um, I'm just fixing a few things. Or, like, uh, I have to stop it from corrupting, or I realise it is corrupting, and stuff like that. But, uh, let's, uh, let's do our own mission, shall we? And we're in. Right. So anyway, what happened in the last episode? Nothing really interesting happened after we hacked in and everything. We got out of there. Everything alright? That's about it. We had a bit of a chase. Uh, I didn't get much. The upload was cut off. Shit. I knew it. Okay. I have to find a way in myself. Are you crazy? <laughs> Even if you did get inside there, we can't read it. It's encrypted. What am I supposed to do? Damien has Nikki. Just tell him he can keep her? Of course not. Of course. I'm not saying that. But he's playing you. Yeah. I'm not going to give him this before I know what it is. Damien cannot be trusted. I know that. All right. Well, let's just... Let's just deal with one problem at a time. All right? If I can get this information, can you decrypt it? No. It's way beyond my skill. Then who then? Hey, what about that, uh, that crazy guy, uh, Tobias? He used to work here. Okay, that's where we start then. Okay, but we need to be discreet. I know how to be discreet. 
Sorry. Okay. Okay. Wow. Wow. Raymond Kenny. It has to be him. He was a software engineer hired for the CTO startup. He created the encryption. The creator always have a backdoor. Wait, he can decrypt it? Kenny is crazy good. I bet he built this room. He's a genius. No, no. I mean a legend. I'm guessing legends aren't easy to find. He's way off the grid. No one's heard of him in over a year. Mm, he's lurking somewhere. Okay. Everyone has a history online. We start there. We get Kenny's last known point and work backwards. He's been gone over a year. This could take a while. There. His cover distracts very well, but he's bounced through one location a few times. So we trace it back and we find his location? In theory, yes. You need to reach that point and connect me to the computer. I'll run a search from the bunker. And we'll have Kenny. So yeah, if you guys were wondering what happened after um, Big Bug got caught, what happened is his, uh, his dog tag or whatever got thrown out the window. Uh, I'm sorry, um, he threw some out the window, I can't really remember what it was, I think it was uh, um, the audio listening device, what we used to plant on him, so we could hear what they were saying. And then, uh, we'll take this one, because it's a nicer colour. Right, let's find out where we need to go, shall we? And then, um, we had, then we had to get out of there, and, um... We got chased a little bit, and after that we'll find. Okay, I'm gonna figure out which one's the quickest way to get there. I guess I'll go by the bottom one over there. Okay. So anyway, I thought I would include those in there at the beginning because uh, last episode we missed out on them. Actually, I'm gonna take that car. If we find Kenny, you need to be careful. He's a very dangerous man. Dangerous, huh? What's his story? He's a Bloom whistleblower, or a cyber terrorist. Depends on who you ask. Delivered his message by blacking out most of New York State. I remember that. 2003. Not just New York, that was most of the Northeast. Killed a couple of people. He killed 11 people. They called it a software error. What the hell was his message? Kenny was trying to warn everyone. He didn't trust people inside Bloom. But I don't think he expected anyone to die. Now, he's in hiding. And we're about to find him. The place you're going is the very end point of Raymond's last signal. Hackers hide their locations by routing their packets through buttons. Yeah, it's a good trick. I've tried it myself. He's probably bounced his signal all across the globe. We'll have a problem if that signal ends in China or some faraway country. No, he's here. I don't care if he's gone off the grid. If this Kenny's ex bloom Something tells me he wants to stay close to the action. Maybe. But if he really was in Chicago, why has he been so quiet? He's not a kind of guy to just sit back and watch. You said he killed those people. Must be a pretty price on his head. Good reason to stay underground. Aiden, we might have a problem. I'm picking up a lot of chatter about Rem and Kenny. That's strange timing. You said this guy's been dark for a year. I think we might have alerted someone when I found Raymond's signal. So we'll have company waiting for us. All right. Jesus, how long are you gonna wait? Sending someone out. That guy. Yeah. I don't even know what I'm supposed to do. Looks like no one's been here in months. Right, okay. It's A to get against stuff. I just had to remember the controls there. Alright, um... He's the only guy over here, so... I think we can just sneak up here, actually. There we go. Ooh, there's been... There's a few in here. Keep an eye out. Okay. Ooh.
still be someone around. Okay, we need to take out him and him. We need to take him out over there before he calls for backup. Can't stop. Search over there. Uh, if you if you can see the two lines around the body, that means uh, they can call for backup. And if they've just if they've got nothing around them, it means they can't do crap really. All right, let's just blow this guy up on this one over there. Now. Okay, there we go. Now they can't call for backup, so that means we're in the clear. Really. There's only three left anyway, so. I got nothing. Check over there. Oh, there's another guy there. Can you call for backup? I got nothing. No. Check over there. Looks clear. I'm heading that way. There's nothing here. Moving on. Never mind. Screw it. We're done. Stay on the lookout. Lock down. Heads up! Search that way. Look out! Come on, dude. Pop your head up. Grenade's going in. Stay sharp. No, this isn't right. Ah! One of us is down. Yeah, I'm in over my head. Yeah, you like you are. Do it. Do it. Help him. There we go. Shit. Someone's on to us, Clara. Let's make this quick. What am I looking for? Connect me to the computer. I'll run a search from the bunker. Yep, uh, hack into it. Wow, old school shit. No wonder good cops can't shut the club down. Okay. Clara, it's online. Okay. Looks like we're gonna have to call in some heavy ordnance here. Yeah. There we go, 100%. There we go. Sweet. One more guy. There we go. It's done. Pawnee. Pawnee? That's the best you could come up with, Ray? I better wipe the hard drive. I don't want anyone else tracking Kenny. There we go. Click, 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 click. Shit, he's taking off. Guy's got a lead on Kenny. Can't risk him running. Aiden, someone's had They can't find Kenny. You can't let them. 
I know, I'm on it. I'll shut them down. Hurry. Um, come on, Aiden, run. Thank you. It's gonna have to do. It's Villian Guild, whoops. There we go. We're catching up now. I didn't get that far anyway, so. We're not doing anything against this guy. Let's get out of this CQS area. Shit, they're gonna get a feed on us. Crap. We've got a high powered patrol car in pursuit of suspects. Why aren't they going after the bloody idiot in the fire engine? This car doesn't handle very well at all. God damn it. We're boxed in. He's gonna get away. I'm completely boxed in. There we go. Come on. There we go, we're right up behind him again. You're not gonna spin me out, you're just gonna push me against the freaking crash barrier. God, this ain't good. There we go. Back on his tail again, but. I don't think this car is going to uh, take much more of this. There we go. We've got eyes on again. Sorry. Just killed another bloody civilian. Ah, crap, we're pinned in between two of them. Now there's a third one behind us. Please, please don't give up. Don't really want to run under any more civilians. Ah, chased them all that way just to die. God damn it! I should have really just jumped out and shot them at crap, but I didn't. God damn it! <laughs> um. It's done, Pawnee. Pawnee. That's the best you could come up with, Ray. I better wipe the hard drive. I don't want anyone else tracking Kenny. We gotta wipe the hard drive. I thought it was just run out, run the hell out of there and go after them again, but nope, we gotta wipe the hard drive first. So we'll wipe the hard drive. 
shit, he's taking off. Guy's got a lead on Kenny. Can't risk him running with it. Aiden. I know, I'm on it. I'll shut them down. Hurry. Right, I've got an idea to stop the CTOS uh, finding us. I'm not 100% if it's going to work or not. We'll go the same way we did last time. Shit. Hit the bloody merry-go-round. Right, I've got an idea to stop them, but I'm not 100% if it's going to work or not. Right bumper to blackout, okay. If these don't work, I'm going to try something else. Right, I'm just going to stick right behind them and... There we go. If I have to, all I need to do is hit right bumper and that's it. That didn't work. Crap, go, 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 go. Nope, they're gonna get us, they're gonna get us, they're gonna get us. No, they're not. CTOS is inconclusive, we don't have him. CTOS has got a blackout. There we go. If we have to, we can always use another one. There we go. Back on the same road as this guy. So what we're going to do is now we're just going to stick behind him. At least now we don't have the police following us at every corner. And smack it into us. Should have really what happened on the first one. There. Right, okay. Stop. Get out. Kenny's mine now. Okie dokie. Okay. Right guys, I'm going to call this episode here and uh, well after we've had our phone call and there we go, we've got a nice little 10G achievement. Oh, complete act 2, okay now we're on act 3. I got what I need, we're ready. You're actually going after Ray Kenny. I can't believe we found him. I haven't found him yet, but we're close. He might not even help, you know. If he decrypts those files, he's exposing himself. This guy was a whistleblower. You said those files had blackmail on Bloom. There was blackmail on everyone. I think an ex-Bloom radical would find that hard to resist. When you find Ray Kenny, what do you have to offer him? We've seen what happens when we dig. If he helps us decrypt those files, he's exposed. I'll find something. There's a reason he's hiding. Here. He turned against Bloom, exposed their abuse. I can work with that. You're going to threaten him? No. A whistleblower wants justice. He may be looking for a cause, and I can definitely give him one. So guys, we're going to go ahead over and find Raymond Kenny, I think his name is. And hopefully this episode hasn't gone all wonky honky and skibbity skibbity and everything and crackly crackledy and everything. And uh, I hope everybody's enjoyed this episode and uh, I'm sorry about all the other episodes. Uh, hold on, I'm getting another phone call. I was just chatting with Nikki here. Saucy girl. You touch a hair, and I'll snap your neck. No surprise your siblings. She's a hothead like you. Why are you calling? She's wondering if you're coming to collect her. I said I'd check. I found someone who can decrypt the data. I'm all ears. His name's Raymond Kenny, an old CTOS developer. He's in Pawnee. I'm heading there now. Well, that is news. But I'm gonna use my veto here. What veto? He created the encryption. 
Raymond Kenny is also a whistleblower. He's going to unlock all those juicy files and put them on the goddamn news. You know what secrets are when they hit the news? Worthless. I'm warning you. Find another way. There is no other way. You want this done, you need to get off my back and let me do it. Damien sounded worried. He's after the blackmail in those files. What's his game? What's he planning to do? Alright, I can't let him distract me. Kenny's the answer. He'll help me decrypt everything. And I'll get Nikki safe. Sorry about that guys, but uh, right there somewhere, um, my uh, Elgato stopped recording and turned itself off. So I had to pull this footage right now from the Xbox itself from the game DVR. I'm sorry about that, but we're going to call this episode right here guys. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned for the next episode. Peace guys.